Hello, my name is Dr. Mike Abrams, and I'm a licensed psychologist in New York and New Jersey and a professor at New York University. I'm here for About.com to discuss the various types of depression. Depression must be distinguished from sadness and grief that are an inevitable part of life and generally do not warrant clinical treatment. Mental health professionals put depression in the category of mood disorders. There are several types of related mood disorders, one of which is known as dysthymic disorder or dysthymia. The individual with this condition is chronically down, often fatigued, and negative in his or her approach to life. It is effectively a prolonged minor depression. Within the diagnosis of major depression, there are several ways that it can present. It can range from mild to severe, and even involve a loss of contact with reality. Major depression can occur once or across many years in repeated episodes. It is sometimes linked to giving birth and is then considered postpartum depression. Depression is almost always a component of bipolar disorder. In this condition, the depressed mood alternates with a mildly expansive mood called hypomania or an irrationally exuberant mood called mania. Depression may also be a component of a disorder called schizoaffective disorder in which the afflicted individual suffers disorders of thought, perception, and social judgment which also cycle between depression and elevated moods. A less severe depression may be present in a condition called adjustment disorder with depressed mood. In this case, the afflicted person is overwhelmed with life stress and reacts with a brief depressed state. In a substantial number of people, the reduced daylight during the colder season can produce a depressed mood. This is referred to as seasonal affective disorder. There are many other conditions that may result in a depressed mood. These include dementia, drug withdrawal, and depressions that don't easily fit into any diagnostic category. The most relevant basis for diagnosing depression is how one feels. Depression is a painful and disruptive emotional state, and the person suffering is the number one expert on how he or she feels. If you think any of these conditions apply to you, please seek help. That was a little information about the different types of depression. To learn more, please visit about.com. Thanks for watching.